All right, so now first we need to change this string resource. So for this string resource, I'm gonna have string resource and pause the TV. Now we remove this one. And for the unspecified type, we don't want to add constant here. We're just gonna also return a specific a string resource, which is B uh, type couldn't identify that and the problem is we're turning a string we want to turn your text so your no, text is not subtype for overall so that's exactly what we're gonna need to do uh, you need to go to the data decoder to the decoder and change the type to your eye text now in your samsung the problem is fixed all right, now for the type, we found the UI text that's probably gonna change later. All right, for the country, if you have seen that we have a hard coded uh, string here, that's not what we want. We want to use an a string ID resource ID. So I changed the hard coded into uh, a string resource and we need to change the string resource of our country so i'm just gonna make string resource for our country to become enter and that's probably gonna cause an error because of the key and value so for me uh if we went back here we have country map uh, months and year so for some months and years they are really the close to together so i will make another two generic types it will be country key and the other one will be country value and for the so for the months i will not want date key and date value and all what I need is I change the country map to use our country key and value types. So now I will need to add my types here. It's going to be char and in the first two, uh, first two which is key value are for the country, and second two are for the months and year. All right. So now for our country map is now fixed. Now we have our problem with the country. Now we need to return the type to UI text, and instead of returning a country map directly, we're just going to use UI text to string resource, and we take the resource ID of this one, which is uh, is Korea or Romania or whatever. And now we're just going to return UI text to string resource. And we'll turn our string to country, just put it to specify country. And for this problem, because we are overriding from the decoder, we want to change it to UI text. Now that should be working fine. Yes. Now we have a problem with our manufacturer entity because it accepts a string. We need to change it to UI text. Same with the country. And now went back to Samsung now it's gonna work fine so that's that's for the months as uh, for the country and type now if we went to the date is there any problem here we actually yes we have this problem where it's there is mid at which isn't really the optimal so we're gonna change it to our text and we want to return your text with string resource uh, resource ID it's gonna be it's gonna be all the string made uh, in and we're gonna pass um, it's not made in it's made at and to be actually we don't really need to uh, 
uh, to have any made in its I think it's gonna be just the specific manufacturing date so yeah opening the figma uh, we don't need to specify made in so I'm just gonna change it I'm not gonna use string resource I'm gonna use dynamic string uh, actually we don't need the dynamic string as well but if you want to use it you can and it will provide consistency so I will make a, I will make actually dynamic string just for the consistency reason uh, and it's gonna be this approach so yeah uh, that's it and now we need to change the decoder to accept UI text in this case and now let's see is there any error here yes since it accepts um, the manufacturer entry we need to change it to UI text alright so now our Samsung decoder is amazing now it's allowed for uh, I think it should be work fine. Now, if we went to LG, we will probably have some nice errors, and it actually makes sense. So, if you want, you can do it yourself. It's going to be the same as previously implemented in our Samsung decoder. If you want to keep up with me, feel free to do so. For this one, it's going to be first. We're going to need to change these elements. So. I will do it then come back to you all right so I have just added all those stuff and this one is just China and now we need to change our country map to, to accept a string and it's called integer so now we need to change the manufacturing to a, so what's a country key a country key is just a string and country value type is just an int Right, so now uh, our map is now working fine for the country and for the type I'm just going to give you a text and this one I'm going to make you a text string resource and it's going to take resource ID type TV and this one is going to be your text and I'm just gonna copy the same as Samsung. So it's gonna be this one. And for the undefined country, it's gonna be the same as Samsung. Alright, for the for the date, it's gonna be UI text. And the date is similar to Samsung. Yeah. Alright, so now our LG is correct and Samsung decoder is correct. Let's rebuild the project and see if there's something wrong or not. Alright, so after building, I had this problem and sent me directly to this home screen. So that's because manufacturer entity now this date is in the UI text. So all we need to do is just call it as string and now we have our title as string and for the manufacturer item made entity dot country this country is your text so we can actually make it as a string and for this type we can also make it as a string so it's that's probably it now let's check our view model our view model we have another problem here that from manufacturer uh, manufacturer entity so it's gonna be your well, text dot string resources um yeah i'm gonna use the string resources and i will pass all the string we need to import our resources uh, loading or uh, on this say just call date let's say I couldn't identify date and we actually can see 
put uh, put it on the front country and we also need to delete so first row so that's for the so for the type so that's my match for the type because I did identify type and I want to do the same for for the country and date and now I don't need this all right so that's basically it rebuild again and see what happens right so there is no problem so far so that's it for now